Oh, hello, and welcome to my sound lab. Okay. This is Marshall. He is my hello. assistant. Let's look at the keyboard. Let it go, let it go, I'm one with the wind and sky, let it go, let it go. So we have our signals from the vocal and from the piano, and then they go through the board. And then we have our main, and we have our aux. Uh, so the aux goes in, the aux end goes into that, and then comes goes in there, and then comes out, and then goes into the amp for the monitors. And then this one goes straight in but then we have the main insert going through there, so it's kind of going there, then there, but internally in the board. Here's the board, here's Mike, uh, here's gain, the arch, here's my EQ, and there's my fader. Then I'll go through this like a top view. Gain, aux end, EQ, Fader up above in case I missed something and then I put this one here so we Marshall and I were talking and from Marshall's video which comes before this video uh, we think that the signal goes in post gain not pre gain so that's why the gain does nothing to actually affect the mp3 volume uh, I don't have, I had some aux ends, but I turned it off because I wasn't sure whether or not I needed it. And then there, it, I have it faded like that, and there's my main mix. And that was off, which was annoying. Also, I have low cut on, on all the channels that I'm using, but I was tempted not to do it on the piano because the piano is kind of acting like a bass. So, yeah, but I did it anyway. Uh, and then here is my graphic EQ with Marshall, Marshall Wave. Uh, I really don't like the bass frequencies in here. Marshall, you're making it sound like I made a pop. I didn't make a pop. It was Marshall oh, hitting a mic. Time's pressing buttons. No. Anyway, so I had the basses turned down. Uh, I don't feel like it really uh, needs it in here. <laughs> and that's basically it. I have some little stuff up here, and then some stuff here, but that's mostly it. I can do Dark side too. Well, I can have a dark side.